drop it down, and ramp it. Oh, 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 he's dead. Yep, okay, we need a bit of a pig. <laughs> How's it going guys? Dre here and welcome back to another episode of Carry It Away. Now today we're gonna hopefully complete the Rookie Mountains. Uh, the first episode we did seven of them, we got seven left. Who knows how hard these things are though, that's the goal, it might not happen. Now looking around the map, I didn't realize this, but you didn't really have to go in order. You can actually kind of explore the map and choose what you want to do, which is actually really cool. We're obviously going to do all of them, the question mark, that's really curious right there. Uh, I think we'll leave that one for last, let's actually try... No, because that one's 13, I don't want to do that one either. Sorry, I'm being a little picky. Let's do back to front, uh, because that's the only one on the left-hand side of the mountain left, so we may as well start there and get right back into it, keeping skiers safe. Or killing them, that's fun too, you know? Gotta love a good skier accident from time to time, you know, when it's not a real thing, because that's horrifying when it is a real thing. Anyways, uh, right now, so we gotta get across this little gap here. Not really too much to this one. Actually, are we starting? We are starting from over there, so we have to go this way. This is tripping me out. Because we're on the left-hand side of the map, uh, the world, I guess that's the way we're going. So, for right now, we don't really need to go too high, so let's just try something like this. Uh, again, I'm not gonna build anything too crazy here, but that kind of looks nice. And if we drop that down, we can't really raise that up. So, what if we flatline that like that, and then go... Well, I don't want to go too high because I need to kind of just go right over this tree because I need to get that star. So, we're going to drop that down to right about there. That actually should be all we need to... Wait, no, we're not going to be able to... Well, let's just see what happens when we attach the rope together because we might need to do a little bit more here. We might need to not. So, I just want to add some more reinforcement here since... This is pretty basic right now. I really wish we could put it in the middle. Let's actually turn off grid, and that looks like the middle to me. That looks good. All right, so we got some wheels. Let's put some wheels on there. Is there anything else that we didn't have? Oh, we actually can use chain. I'm wondering if I should have used the chain. All right, let's just see what happens when we do something like that. Are, is the feet going to hit it or not? We didn't even need that wheel, but let's just try it and see what happens. Ooh, it's a little bit wobbly. You can see the shake here. Oh, God! They fell off. I didn't even know that was a thing. Okay, so the rock ahead of it knocks them over and it made the one fall off. Mind you, if we let... No, I don't think... <laughs> what just happened? I totally missed it, but he fell off too. I think it's because it's swinging too much. So maybe because it's going too high up. All right, so we're going to delete that. And what I might do is just lower this down a little bit. Let's not go too crazy here. We just need something. Well, we can't lower it down because then there's the rock there too. So what if we uh, put a wheel up here, kind of try and shift this weight a little bit. So at least now both of the wheels are working. I don't know if we'll be able to touch that. Oh, yeah, we should be able to touch the star. It's just it's still really, really swinging. So I don't know how to address that. Not as bad this time, though. So I think we should actually, unless this breaks... Ah, oh, man, I jinxed it. I totally jinxed that one, and he just flew right into the tree. Jesus. All right, let's try these chains out. Can we connect over? We can't connect over to that one, so I'm actually just going to delete that. Uh, what we're going to do, we're going to straighten this out. Usually a straight pull doesn't break as much as a bent pull, so we'll try something like... Oh, oh, okay. Well, that, that, that worked well. All right, let's try something like that. We just added more to it, and that actually looks extremely stable. The big question is, is that enough to get... Oh, yeah, no problem at all. The star. All right, I think that should be it. This second guy's pretty heavy, but... Yeah, we're totally fine this time. Oh, I hit the... Ch no! Okay, oh, I jinxed it. What the heck? What was the difference? Is that guy just a little bit taller so his skis hit the tree? That's probably it, so... The easy fix for that will be to just lift this. I can't lift it anymore. Great. Jad, that's just fantastic game. Okay, so what do I do? I'm going to have to build even higher, aren't I? No, because if I do that, you know, let's just try it again. Let's just see if maybe we can get lucky. And this time he doesn't swing. Any okay, that one fell that time. And the second one made it. What the heck? I, I, I love how it's random, though. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. Okay, so... To address the tree issue, we are going to have to expand this out a little bit. I'm wondering if I raise that. No, because it's maxed out here. But if I raise this, now, what's maxed out right now? I don't even know. 
All right, it's this pole right here, I think. So if I bring this up and then bring this up, I also lowered the other one a little bit. That might be good. Let's slow it down just to make sure we got that. I don't think it's gonna hit the, oh, now it hit the rock. Are you serious? I didn't expect this to be so difficult. Ski lifts are not an easy thing, man. Okay, so that should have fixed that. Let's hope moving that didn't do anything though. We're getting, oh, what the, what did you just, why did you just fall? I need a replay here. This is, okay, so, oh, yeah, it did get stuck in the rock. Why did it get stuck in the rock? I lifted it higher. All right, we changed it a little bit. It's very wobbly now, as you can see, so I had it good before, and I don't even know why, because it was down here like that. So let's see the difference. Is it just because she kind of just drags it the right way? Yeah, it seems to be that's the case. Okay, let's see if this works, though. Maybe we can get lucky. Uh, oh, get, that one fell. Okay, the rock is still affecting me. All right, we're expanding our empire here. So, yes, it's ugly, but that's exactly how I want it to be. We're going to raise them up like crazy. I'm hoping this works. I have no idea. So we're going to have to delete this real quick. And this time we'll go like that and then like that. So we got to raise them really high. That's, that's going to be too high. And because it's so high, actually, we're not going to be able to get the star. But we'll see if this can work. Just to see... I don't know how I would get that star, though. I guess I could use... Hold on here. Let me actually try that. I got, I got an idea. So if we wrap this around like that, and then wrap that around like that, that should be it! That... Oh, my God. This is crazy. Oh, and she broke. Okay. <laughs> so the wheel doesn't necessarily need to be that high. Let's try... Again, this thing is ugly as heck. But you know what? We still have... To... I think it was $3,000 to do this. Yes, it was $3,000 and it's looking is this oh, what the heck? What happened now? Why can't you guys just just do it right look at that guy made it. Why did you fall off? Seriously? Okay, this has got to be it. I, I, I'm doing it again this time. Let's see what happens. Does she fall again? So she did hit the tree. She made it though. Oh, please make it. Okay That's it Oh, the first time it didn't work, but we tried it again, and it actually did. So, I didn't mean to do that. We're going to return to the main menu. That one should be completed now, I hope, uh, because that was a rough one. I did not expect that. Yes, it is. As you can see, it's blue over there. So, we did make it, and we got all the objectives and all the medals. So, can't get much better than that. All right, well, I got a bit confident saying we might be able to do all 14 today. That one took me way longer than expected, so... I don't know if that's the case. All right, what level is this one? The cannon's level 9, so let's try that one first, because uh, I believe that's the lowest one, and then we're going on to, like, 11. All right, so the cannon. I wonder... Whoa, there is a cannon. Uh, what does that cannon do? Okay, so it blows back, it seems like. We start from which side? Yeah, we do start it from over here. So we got some blowback from the cannon. I'm assuming... I don't know if it freezes them or what it does. We're going to find out, but we do obviously need to go over that. Good thing about this one is we can use wood. How much money do we have? We have $5,000, so this is going to be a pretty big build. So with that in mind, I'm actually going to connect these together, and I might build this whole starting one with wood just because we can. And we can even cross that just like that. Uh, we have to make it over the rock. So I'm thinking what I'm going to do is build something rather small here. We'll connect a wheel like right here, and then we need to build a big tower on the right-hand side of that rock. So with that in mind, actually, I think I'm going to spend the vast majority of my money on the other side. We're going to just do this with uh, timber, because I don't think we need to build anything too crazy. So if we do something like that, that might be good, and then we'll just kind of expand this up a little bit, and that should be it. All right, it isn't pretty, but it should hopefully do what I want to do. Now, we might add more to this structure later, depending on how high I can build this. So, the fact that these things are basically straight stable, uh, that's really good. So, we can do something like that. Can we even connect these? No, but if we lower this down just a little bit, like that... Oh, man, even still we can't. Okay, I thought we could go a lot higher with these things. All right, I think we want the base to be nice and sturdy, though. So we're at 2,500 right now. I can spend 3,000 if I want to get within range. So actually, I might delete one of these poles just to see. Ooh, that might be risky, but I kind of want to see what happens. I think I'm going to go from timber from here on, though, and we're just going to build a nice straight tower. Which is easier said than done, because timber, you can't actually make that big. Now, is that big enough to get all the way across? Yes, it is. So that's as big as I can make the tower. So what we're going to have to do in the middle here is kind of have a connect point. 
And we'll just see if that will work. All right, we'll ungrid once again. Make this nice and stable. That actually looks really good. Now, is that going to be enough to lift it above this? Let's find out. We'll put two wheels here. That's still within the budget, so that's good. And it looks like it might be good, but you never know with a game like this. So let's try it. Oh, God. Here we go. Okay, so this one should be good at the bottom. It's actually quite green, which is surprising to me. I thought that would break for sure. Now, oh, 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 wind. Wind gusts. How are you staying on there? Okay, hitting the tree. <laughs> Jeez. Oh, we made it. Wait. Wait, you almost did it. Hold on. Hold on here. Hold on. If they can land it, they might be able to make it. But obviously, that's not optimal. I think we need to go a bit higher. So what we're going to do, that should be actually a very easy fix, is to just make a, a beam right up here like so. Let's bring that down a little bit because we can't connect them together. And then bring it all the way up. That actually looks good. We'll ungrid that so we can go right to the tip, like so. And try this again. This time, hopefully, we don't hit the tree. It's... Whoa! Oh, yeah. Okay, I forgot. Wait, I did connect it to it. So, it can rip off the rope, even. That's really cool. But we're gonna do that. That looks actually really good. It's very straight and stable. The only thing I'm worried about is the wind. That can really screw this up. And, ooh, we're getting a little bit red over there. I might need to upgrade those things. Ooh, oh, God. Yeah, it broke it. And landed right on the cannon. There she goes. All right. Well, you didn't make it. You need to go to the other side, not this side. All right. Screw it. Let's see if we can actually do this within budget. I don't know if that's going to happen, but we'll try. I want to do all the outsides with wood. Now, unfortunately, that is not in budget, but we actually might be able to... Get rid of a lot of this over here, and 3,100? Seriously? Oh, we're so close. All right, let's just try that just to see if this kind of has something going on with it. Oh, man, it is so windy. It actually lifts it right off that uh, pulley, which is crazy. All right. Oh, she's doing a flip. She's doing a flip. She is committed to it. Did that just break the, the bottom? It did. Wow. Wow. Okay, at this point, I'm saying goodbye to budget, and I am building something structurally stable. I did not expect that, but we don't need to be in budget. I'd like to be in budget, but it is not needed. I just love how she flips every time. Man, that is okay, and she still hits the tree. Great. Good. This is, this is, this is just going flawlessly. Well, the benefit being we did upgrade this, and we can make it quite a bit taller. Why did that get reset down there? Should have went up to the top. That's okay. We can actually just redo this once again. Heck, you know what? We might not even need this over here. Let's try. Let's let's do something risky here, guys. Is that within budget? No, it's not. But if we can just do one... Oh, that is really cool to me. All right, this is going to be dangerous, though. It's pretty low at the bottom. Thankfully, the wind's actually pushing her up. So... Oh, man, that is just so much weight on the pole. Jesus. All right, new idea. So I built another structure here. Actually, I'm going to try and save some money here because all this structure is going to do is try and stabilize the cord. So I built a wheel to go on top of the line to hopefully stop it from being pushed so far up. Uh, that's all this one's doing over here. You know what? I guess just to be safe. Uh, again, since we're spending so much money, let's just put a wheel down below as well so the cord doesn't go too far down as well. And this will kind of keep it nice and stabilized. I'm hoping... Oh, come on. This actually might be good. All right, don't do your flip. Don't break. Oh, God. Oh, tree. Okay, everything's okay. This is not going perfectly, but somebody actually made it to the end. Hit the tree once again, but we're okay. Mind you, I spent $4,000, so we're $982 over budget. I admit that. Uh, I, I was hoping I wouldn't be, but I honestly don't know how to do this without that. So at least we know now we might need to stabilize the cord. And that's exactly what we did to win that one. Ah, uh, so... Oh, it did say I completed it within a specified budget. Wait. Oh! This whole time I've been trying to build it under 3,000 thinking that is, that's what I needed to do. It was under 5,000. I was well within range. All right. Give myself a pat on the back. I, I feel a lot better about myself now. I want to do this one next. I want to go and do a jump. So we're going to do Eagle's Creek. And, uh, yeah, this one should be fun. That is a very, very big jump. So you know we're going to have some fun here. This is just a jump. That's all we need to do. I don't think we even need that big of a jump. So let's just try something like that. You know what? That's probably all we need because we haven't done too many jumps yet. 
So I think this one's gonna be rather basic. So drop it down and ramp it. Oh, 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 he's dead. Yep, okay, we need a bit of a bigger ramp. That was actually close though. All right, so we'll just do something like that. That looks nice and structurally stable. So we might, this might be actually too big of an incline. Oh, oh, it broke. Oh, <laughs> he actually landed down there. Maybe we could actually utilize that. No, you know what? Well, let's just try again and see if it lands exactly the same way. We might be able to do a double jump here. That would be kind of fun. All right, actually, damn. Okay, I'm okay down there. Maybe, just maybe. Let's try something here. Let's go. Gonna be kind of an abrupt jump, but let's try something like that. And then can we connect right to here? Perfect, just like that. I don't know if we'll be within budget. This is obviously not how to do this one, but I always like a little bit of a challenge. So let's see if we can keep the momentum up. There we go, jump down there, land it, and <laughs> smash your face right into the other ramp. So we'll try one more, just kind of stabilizing this a bit. I don't think this is gonna work though. It's too much of a jump at the end. All right, I, I love how I can perfectly, okay, I was just about to say, I love how I can perfectly land down here. That was actually impressive though. I landed on the other ramp and broke it. Why did that time I went further? I've jumped this so many times now, and that was the first one that, oh God. Okay, now it's just totally not working. So you know what? Let's just do it the right way and try and build a better jump at the top. So I think my issue is I'm trying to go for height too much. I need to go for distance. So let's try something like that. Again, we'll do a very basic jump here. So nice and cheap. Oh, I'm so close to the ground. I actually, I really want to see if I can do this as cheap as possible. So we're going to drop this down a little bit, drop that down. And we'll see if we can ramp it like that. At this point, I just want to see if the angle is what I'm doing wrong. So there we go. Oh, oh, we almost made it. We almost got the star there. We did make it, obviously. And we spent probably no money at all. All right, I'm going to try that again, though. Because I want to see if we can possibly get that star. So I increase the angle to jump just a little bit just to see if that will help. There we go. There we go. Oh, Okay, we're dead once again. All right, lower the angle again. It's all about your jump time. There we go. There we go. Oh, it's so close. Oh, man. I hate wiping these guys out because I feel so bad. It is partly my fault after all. Ah, uh, that one's in the ground. Okay, so we can't go much lower than that. Uh, let's turn off grid and make this nice and stable. Get this as far as possible. And you know what? That looks like good trajectory. What just happened? You ruined my ramp. All right, we're trying anyways. I'm trusting you, game. And that's why I have I have trust issues. Oh, that's not good when your jump's yellow before you even hit it. Oh, oh, it actually, I didn't even jump. Okay, that actually worked. I thought it would break because it's already at 53% strained. Mind you, it is basically off a cliff and now it breaks. Game, I don't, I don't understand. <laughs> sometimes you break, sometimes you don't. All right, try again here. There we go, there we go. It broke at the end. Damn it! I'm so close! This is frustrating. This is harder than I thought once again. Surprise, surprise. All right, raise the incline just a little bit. I mean, it's all about those fine, minute movements, and it's all about jump time, so come on. Go, dude, do All right, that was impressive. I, I, You know what? I appreciate that. That landing was amazing, so good job, man. But we got to do better than that. We were so close. I feel like if we do this jump right, we might be able to get it. So come on. There we go, there we go. And jumped right at the end. And that was worse. Okay. And jump! Yes! Yes! Ho! Land it! Come on! Oh, he died. Okay, so I, I lowered the trajectory quite a bit, actually. So it's almost like a straight jump now. That seems to be what it likes to do. Pull back! Okay. At least we can hit the star now. We just can't make the landing. So that's mostly due to me, though. So let's keep practicing here. And... Oh, man! That was so close. Oh, oh, did we do it? Okay, well, I didn't stick the landing. I really wanted to, but I think you have to basically clear that rock to do it. So what didn't I do? Complete level without any breakages. Unfortunately, I'm gonna have to accept that and just accept my fate. Still though, that was really fun. And now we got a black one. So yeah, we are missing one medal. Again, we can address these medals later, but obviously we did pretty good considering I'm in fourth place right now. So I'm happy with that. What do we want to do now? You know what? Let's try this one out because this is new. So we'll use that. I think that's one of the bigger ski lifts, right? 
Uh, woohoo! High speed mountain travel. The future is here. Gondolas. Yeah, that's what it's called. I couldn't remember the name. Can carry three people at a time. They are also faster and more suited for larger distances. All right, so we're trying out the gondolas now. Uh, wow, this is actually really huge. So this is gonna be fun. How much money do we got before I screw that up? $9,000. Okay, so we got quite a bit of money. I think with this, I, we might even want to stick to all logs. We got lots of attach points here. I think I'm going to build a nice big structure up here. So we'll turn grid back on. So I want to make sure this is nice and straight. Ah, oh, we're so close. Okay, so we'll delete that. We'll turn this in a little bit like so. And then connect that together. I like building straight towers. And it seems to work well. So we'll try that out real quick. Lower this down like so. Mind you, we're probably going to have to add another level here. Yeah, you know what? I'm just going to add a middle thing here. Because I don't want to lower it too much. And finally at the top, we'll just do a nice big triangle. So that should raise us high enough to get to that. Now we just need to build a basic structure down here so we're not hitting trees. So I don't really know what I'm going to try and build here. I'm just going to build higher than the trees. So can we connect that together? Yes, we can. Now can I connect that? Perfect. That's actually going to work really well. I don't think, yeah, it's too far to do the bottom. I don't think we'll need that anyways. We should be pretty structurally stable here. And again, we want to make sure we're nice and high. Keep this rope pretty stable because we don't want it to be really rocky. Then bad things happen as well. And you know what? Let's just connect. Uh, that won't help if we connect that to that. But if we do something like that, that actually might be good. Uh, you know what? I think we're going to have to raise this up a little bit. So you know what? Let's just go and do something like that. And finally, we'll connect these together. Hold on here. Just got to move this in a little bit and connect those together. Now, hopefully that should be good. I don't know. This is a first try. Probably not going to be perfect, but we'll give her a go. You know what? I'm actually going to do three wheels there because I got a little bit of a plan. I want to keep this cord nice and stable. So we're going to kind of weave it through that and then over this to the end. Is that going to work? I have no idea. It's actually looking really, really stable. We're within budget, too. I did spend a lot of money, but we're still within budget. Ooh, a little scared about that one over there. Ooh, God. There it goes. No, it was so close, too. It was doing good right until the end. So what if we expand that out a little bit? That might be all it needs to do. It just needs to straighten it a little bit, and we'll see. So we'll speed it up. Yeah, it's looking much better now. Oh, oh. Still turning a little bit orange, but... I think we got it, and yes, indeed, we did. All right, that feels good. You know, I like this one. And I just noticed I missed a star. Okay, so back to the drawing board we go, because you know we're getting that star. So we're going to have to, you know what, let's just delete this. And I'm going to delete this wheel, because we need to make it higher. So to do that, we're going to have to... Oh, man, we are going to be over budget now. I know that for sure. And that actually might be all we need to do, though. It's almost within budget, so we might be able to knock off some money here. Let's just see if it works first, though. Actually, we'll get rid of that one wheel. I don't know how much these are worth. Not that much money, but that actually should be good, though. I don't think we need a top wheel to keep it nice and stable. We'll find out real quick, though, if we need that wheel. Actually, we might... Ooh, you know what? Let's bring this up a little bit. That way, we're connected to all the wheels. Okay, so... Ooh, God, it's already orange, and there she goes. All right, I think I just got both the stars. I just did some fine-tuning, and yes, that is all we needed to do. Unfortunately, now I am over budget, so I think we're going to end this one here, guys. We will address this later on and see if we can go under budget. Right now, though, that was actually pretty difficult, so we're going to go back and call it a day, I think. So how many did we end up doing? Because I felt like we did quite a few. So we did a few. Uh, had, obviously, a little bit more problems this time. Obviously, the game's going to get progressively and harder and harder. Uh, so next episode, we should definitely finish the Rookie Mountains and move on to the Alps. So I hope you guys enjoyed this one. We're going to wrap it up here. As always, guys, thanks for watching and liking, and I'll see you in the next one.